Alright guys, this is the Brick Bros, or Brick Bros Productions as we are sometimes called, and this is the Leg Air Technic service truck, which we are going to review today. You have nice grill right there, you have four wheel steering on each side, well not four wheels turn on each side, but two wheels turn on each side, like so. Controlled by that knob, you got nice warning lights up there, they don't light up or anything like that. There's your battery box right there to control all the power functions, which are included, if you're wondering. There is a function box on each side. This one controls the pneumatics. Yes, this set does feature pneumatics. Right there. You see it. I want to put it in neutral. And then this controls the crane or the tow up and down. Can't really do that because that's piston controlled. And if I flip it around for you, which I'll just pick it up, you have outriggers to go up and down for the controls there. And then you have a winch control, which only goes up. For the pneumatics, you can, as you can see, we have this funny little yellow pieces. So when you turn on the pneumatic, um, when you go to this side, it has that little diagram. That is showing this right there. And whichever one you do or whatnot, it does that. And when you do this, the um, this side controls the boom. Can't really slide that in and out because the crane almost. But yeah, and I'll show you all those functions. I want to show you the inside of the cab on this thing. And yes, it does feature opening doors. Let me, uh, take it. I'm gonna move the mirror out of the way. You can't really see it. But right there, you got some controls. And I'm right behind the steering wheel. And then there's another set of controls, like one that kind of looks like a walkie-talkie. Can't really see it, but, yeah. This is the iPad, too, so it's not that good quality. Put that back. Alright. Now, what you've been waiting The motorized functions. So, which one do you want to see first? I kind of want to do the outfit. So, I'll open the panel, slide it on over, and you can see the red arrow points down and the green arrow points up. As you can see, there's green and red arrows. So, that gear is engaged. Let us watch this. Yeah, a better view. Kind of slow, but it works. I'm gonna have it down now. Sometimes it does it faster, a little bit faster if you push down. Not much faster. Alright, so you turn the motor off. And I will display pneumatic functions now. This will be disengaged. Can't really see it, but it takes over is neutral. And then I want pneumatics, so push that lever over there. It doesn't really matter which way you press it. Over here. Disinfect it. And for the boom function, I'm going to slide out. It's kind of hard to do. I just pull it out and I can get it. Turn up my watch. So, I'm going to push that part down right now, and it just comes back up, then you do this, there you go, that is it for pneumatic functions, nothing else, alright, now I'll be showing you everything else here in a second,
a little bit. And I will turn this off and put that on. And then you can watch it play. We should put it all the way back in so nobody gets hooked right there. Like it did there. I kind of like to leave it hanging just a little bit. Like, so. You can pull a lot, but I'm probably not going to show you all that because I'll take a little too long. Then, my last thing. This guy. Makes a horrible sound. I'm gonna go too far. This is something you get right now. Alright. That's it for the Lego Technic truck. It is somewhere around $130 to buy in stores or online at lego.com. There is, uh, I believe, the set number. Actually, I don't know the set number, but please wa please thank you for watching. Please subscribe and please like. Thank you. Brook Bros out.